Hey guys, what is up, Stefan here. Today I want to do a quick tutorial on how to get around this error on your PlayStation 4 or Xbox console that happens when you have set your net on PFSense on a too strict level for the PlayStation or Xbox to communicate with the internet so you are actually not able to play with your friends or voice will not work or you will have some connection problems and stuff the like. So we are going to look into how to solve this problem. I came across this question several times on the internet already and I thought it's finally time to do a video on it. So I tried this with PlayStation 4 and I think in a friend's place with this Xbox One or something like that. I have no really idea about the Xbox, but it worked either way in both cases. So let me quickly run you through the steps on what you need to do to get it to work and to change the net type from 3 to 2. So you simply have to log into your PFSense firewall over your web browser, go to firewall, go on net. Don't wonder this is a freshly installed PFSense just for uh, lab purposes so there is nothing much going on here. And then you navigate to outbound you want to set your outbound net mode to hybrid. I'm not sure it works with automatic outbo uh, outbound net as well, um, but I always or almost always use hybrid outbound net rule generation, which indicates that it's automatic outbound net plus the rules you set below. So that's what we want to do. So select that, click on save, click on apply changes, and now we can go ahead and create the rule. So go ahead here and click on add. Then we want to select our interface, which in this case is WAN, this is correct. Then we need a protocol, which is any, that's also correct. Then we want to select a source, which in this case is a network address and there you want to put the IP address of your console so in my case for example that would be whatever 112 whatever it got from the HCP of course you can give it a fixed IP address and then you want to select 32 here which basically means it's only for this one IP address and not for a whole range of addresses so only your this rule only applies really to your Xbox or to your PlayStation console then as a destination we want to also choose any so leave it as it is then translation address this is also fine and very important is to make check mark here on static port then you give it a description for example ps4 xbox one or whatever the newest xbox is net click on save click on apply now double check everything when interface the ip address of your console source port any destination port any or destination any destination port any net address is one address it's fine net port any and static port checked make sure you saved everything and now you should be able to connect to the internet with your console you should be able to use voice communication and everything should be working fine please let me know in the comments below if it worked for you I uh, would be really interested in that and I really hope this could help some of you. If so, please subscribe to the channel and leave this video a thumbs up and see you in the next one guys.